Hi guys, um, I hope you're having a good day today. Today, Nash is ready for his story, right Nash? Yep, he's ready for story time, okay? So I hope you're ready too. Today we're gonna read Grasshopper Gus, okay? What do you, th what is this right here? What did it tell us it was in a title? Grasshopper, right? And what's his name? Gus. So that's who the story's going to be about, okay? What color is Grasshopper Gus? What color is he? Good. He's green. Are you guys ready? Okay, let's turn the page. Grasshopper Gus loves falling asleep to his dad's soft, sweet lullabies. All of his friends ask for a bedtime story, but Gus prefers a song. So what does he like to listen to? His dad's soft, sweet lullabies when he's trying to go to sleep. Gus learned to make his own music. His dad was a good teacher. He showed Gus how to rub the pegs on his back legs against the hard edge of his wings to create a lovely song. So he's going to rub the pegs on his legs against his wing to make some music, okay? And who taught him how to do that? Who is this over here? It's Gus's dad. Good. Gus and his dad play songs every evening. Gus looks forward to his time each night. So they play music every night before they go to bed. Can you hear the grasshoppers or the crickets playing music? I know I do. Nash, how about you? Do you hear the grasshoppers and crickets play music? Nash said he does too. One night, Gus hears a song that sounds different from his song. He follows the sound and soon discovers a cricket who is making music by rubbing his wings together. Gus loves this different sound. So Gus is a grasshopper, and for him to make music, he rubs the pegs on his back legs against his wings. But the crickets just rub their wings together. Do you think that would make a different sound? Mm-hmm, it does. So we've got a cricket and a grasshopper. Gus introduces himself and asks if he might play along. His new friend, Crandall, is happy to have company. Crandall loves making music just like Gus. The two friends make music together all night. So they're playing their music together. So here's Crandall. And what is Crandall? Is he a grasshopper? No, he's a what? A cricket. Good. And Gus is a grasshopper. Good job. Every night, the two friends practice. The more they practice, the better they become. Soon, their melodies fill the fields. So we've got some music notes coming up that showing us that they're playing music. And then what was this back here? What is this called? A field. That's where they're at and that's where they're playing their music. Some animals in the field begin to gather around each night to hear the lovely harmony created by two friends. So all the animals are gathering to listen to the music. So we've got what? We've got squirrels and we got a what? What is this called? A caterpillar. Good. And we've got a 
a bird, good. And what's this down here? A deer, good. And what are they doing? Why are they all gathering? To listen to Crandall and Gus play their music. Because they've been practicing so hard. Grasshopper Gus and Crandall Cricket became famous for their beautiful songs. Animal friends from miles away come just to hear the lovely music created by two friends who love songs even more than they love a good story. So they became really famous. That means everyone liked them. And all these animals came to hear them play their music. All right, that's the end of the story. So what do we say? The end. All right, guys. I'll see you tomorrow with another video, okay? All right, bye.